Well, hello there, good people of Interwebs. It's me, Rob Tacklebox, and today we're going to review these here weird things I done found, I believe, at the Dollar Tree, or one of the dollar stores. Pretty sure it's Dollar Tree. These are honey peppers stuffed with mango cream cheese. Doesn't that just sound like a great idea, great combination there, people? So I thought I'd give these a try because it sounded weird as hell. I ain't never had none of these before, so we're going to see what the hell they're all about. Open them up here, and I got them. They've been in the refrigerator for a while now. Originally got them to do something else with, but I ain't doing that no more, so I'm just going to review them. And it's all gagloosh. Doesn't that look delicious? Like a science experiment, one of them things you see in a mad scientist's offices. I'm going to spill this shit. Told me a damn. I know I got a towel around here somewhere in this car. There we go. Put this towel down. I don't, pepper juice is all over my dang escape, man. This is a 2008 Ford Escape. A classic car. Ugh. Okay. It smells like some peppers, all right. I was expecting sweet, but it smells like some. Like pepper sauce, pepper, pepper. Just look at that dripping, dripping goodness. So you get that, put that towel down, it's dripping every damn where. All right, got a good close up look at that son of a bitch right there. Doesn't that look appetizing? Looks like somebody cut off a dog wiener and, and uh, dissected it there. That's definitely cheese. Well, it's not bad. Not what you expect at all. It does have the little bit of pepper taste, but it's mostly the cheese you get. Very sweet. But not too sweet. It actually goes good together. Who'd fucking know? I was not expecting that to be halfway decent, but it's pretty damn decent. Have me a sip of coffee out of my cock of the walk mug here because I am the cock of the walk great combination peppers stuffed with the uh, with the whatever the hell kind of cheese is this again cream cheese and some coffee with french vanilla and creamer god damn it I spilt coffee all over my damn console cup holders are not made for coffee cups I tell you what they should be. Well, these are pretty good, though. Surprisingly, there's just the right amount of pepper um, stuffing. Uh, not not stuffing. The cheese is just enough to overpower the pepper, but the pepper's there right off the bat. You taste the you taste the pepper. And then the cheese takes over, and it's got the good cheese taste to it. So they do complement each other surprisingly. You would not think these would go together. Now, apparently, they're not hot sellers. My dad said they're all over the place, like no one's bought them <laughs> besides us. I might have to get me some more of them. In case you're looking to try these damn things. Dittman Fine Food Mediterranean Honey Peppers Stuffed with Mango Cream Cheese Everybody love a Domingo A symphony of flavors A unique Unique gourmet delicious Enjoy as an appetizer Mix in a salad or barbecue For roasted flavor They would be good in all them things They're right I just ain't never seen this shit before, but it, it's the stuff it's packed in is like half syrup, half water. It's pretty good though. I'm surprised. Like I said, this does not look like it would be great. Kind of looks like an artificial crab leg or some shit. But it does compliment. You like pepper? it's really good I'm trying to think what it does taste like something else i've had but i can't put my thumb on it but anyway 
got Dollar Tree around here, but they got some of these. And what I was told, like I said, they are not selling because <laughs> they look weird. But I'm eating them, so they're delicious. I'm really surprised, but yeah, these things are really good. I mean, they dunk it. Weird combination. Of course, cream cheese is one of them things you can put on almost any damn thing and it works. So, I don't know about the mango part. I ain't rightly tasting the mango, but tasting the pepper and the cheese, it's good. Yeah, I thought this one might be one I could go ew to, but it, it's really not. I will incur, incur something I don't like one day, but that's why I'm such a thin, skinny man. Why? Because I don't like so many foods, you know. I'm not the most uh, critique. Maybe if I got something really sweet to try, because I do not like overly sweet things like cream soda or, or uh, you know, just really overly sugar. Or my candy, man. These would go really good with some barbecue or some meat or something because it's really sweet and it balance out the salt, you know. Well, it's not really sweet. It's like a tangy sweet. Good sweet. There you go. It's not like sugary sweet. If that makes any fucking sense. Like pepper sweet. Just the pepper. The pepper part gives you a sweet and then the, the cheese complements it. This is the most interesting video I've ever done. Oh Lord, it's raining here again today. And uh, ran me, ran, I done walked my dogs and pooped them and got them back in the house where we got flooded. Hadn't started pouring yet, but it's going to because get all my cars nice and muddy. Run me inside. But yeah, ain't nothing much happening here. Figured I'd do a review of this. Got a few little other things to review. Working on getting some uh, more things. They're in the works, people. The chug, the, the weird items to chug are coming up soon. Hopefully I'm getting a hold of the, getting a hold of the chicken stock and the oyster juice, I mean, clam juice and uh, some coffee creamer. I'm going to be slamming all kinds of kitchen out. Mmm. Those are pretty damn good. Then there's the leftover of that. I'm keeping that for the guest. Oh, what the hell. People like me slamming things. Here's you some whatever the hell pepper juice. Cheers. Yuck. That's kind of an oily oiliness to it. But anyway, which way, hope you made it through this video. I'll see you with some more interesting videos pretty soon. Hit the like button, check out my other videos if you had, and I'm Rob Tacklebox. Have a good one. <laughs>